We're out here at Pierce Cedar Creek Institute. It's uh, in Barry County. It's got a lot of land, different habitats that they've recreated. Well, this is a biodiversity class. We basically just go out and look at uh, insects and uh, various types of plants and animals and we catch them and analyze them and try to break down certain species and stuff like that of the uh, park. It's Biology 204 and basically it, re it covers the um, environment. I call it an ecological experience because it's, uh, it's giving you well-rounded understanding of the plants, trees, uh, amphibians, insects. I heard about it through the Science Center actually. There were posters up all over the place and I talked to Dr. Matt about it. I've had Dr. Matt for zoology and liked his course so this sounded like a really really fun time. Good way to end up the summer. Well so. we've been here since Saturday. We got here at 8 a.m. on Saturday morning and started hiking from then and we've hiked around the trails yeah. just about every day and collected samples of different things. Some people are looking for amphibians and others for reptiles, others for wildflowers. I'm looking for mushrooms. Reptiles and amphibians is what I was looking for. I was catching a lot of frogs and we were uh, measuring them and you know different types of species, the average length of them as the adult and where we were recording where we caught them and um, like time of day and everything like that. We were just out on the lake releasing butterflies and uh, somehow they all circle up and fly off in the south or some of them uh, fly straight to the shore depending on how old they are or the other things that I don't really know much about. When Dr. Matt brought them in they were, um, some of them were still in the caterpillar stage, some of them had already formed chrysalis and um, we just sort of waited for them to come out and then once they did he marked some of them depending on what day they came out or what day they emerged, he marked them with either a red or a blue uh, marker so that we could sort of track which butterflies were doing what based on their age. My favorite part has been the hiking trails. It's, it, there are some beautiful, um, very captivating uh, trails out here. Um, a lot of good information that I didn't know. Uh, a lot of information on the history of uh, the state and also uh, this part of the state. I think my favorite part is just going out in the 660 acres or whatever it is and catching uh, lots of types of animals like frogs and reptiles and catching snakes is probably my favorite part. You know, chasing after them through the weeds and getting your legs all cut up with briars and stuff. I think that, you know, learning like this is a really great way to learn. So if I went into education, hopefully being able to bring something like this to my students would be really nice. We've got a good broad base of people that have different um, experiences, different knowledge base, and everybody gets together and kind of share their information. So it's been really good. This is probably my favorite class I've taken so far at GRCC and uh, it was definitely worth the money and it's worth the four credits for just it's four credits for a week and everyone here seems to know a lot about something so you learn a lot from different people. Well in a classroom you learn a lot of theory behind things and you can get told something but it's quite a bit different to actually see it in practice. Here you see a picture of something you don't really appreciate all of its intricate uh, little detail, so it's, it's just a different perspective on things.